In the bushes nearby is the reason for her hunger. Three Tyrannosaurus chicks wait, the only survivors from a clutch of 12. The moment they hear the kill, they start calling for food. The mother delivers a slab of Anatta Titan meat. Only four weeks old and less than a meter high, competition is intense between the chicks, and one is already picked on by the other two. They will remain under their mother's protection for at least the next two months. Soon after that, she will abandon them, or worse, view them as food. It is unlikely the outcast will last that long. A few days later, and the mother rests in the warm afternoon sun. Already there is no sign of the smaller runt. He may well have been killed by his siblings. Increasingly, the bickering pair of chicks are happy to wander from their mother to explore their surroundings. From the undergrowth, a snake watches. These reptiles have only recently evolved from the same family as lizards, but already they specialize in hunting warm-blooded creatures such as mammals. To do this, they use special sensory pits on their snouts as a way of detecting the heat signatures of other animals. The snake does not like what it can see. While the chicks play, they are oblivious to approaching danger. The mother is caught completely by surprise. The Ankylosaurus has very little brain inside its reinforced skull. So when faced with danger, it reacts automatically and aggressively. Normally Tyrannosaurus would retreat, but she will not abandon her young. has cracked the mother's femur and ruptured internal organs. She limps away in agony. That night, the usual evening chorus is joined by the whimper of a dying giant. By morning, she lies lifeless on the baking ash fields. The chicks stand expectantly by the colossal corpse of their mother. Hours pass and still they wait. But their fate will now be settled, along with all the other giant dinosaurs of the Cretaceous. Three thousand kilometers to the south, the massive comet crashes into Earth. Ah! 
The light from the impact fades in silence. Then the shock waves arrive. Next comes the blast front. Finally, a rain of molten rock starts to fall out of the darkening sky. This is the end of the age of the dinosaurs. The comet struck the Gulf of Mexico with the force of 10 billion Hiroshima bombs. In the catastrophic climate changes that followed, 65% of life died out. It took millions of years for Earth to recover, and when it did, the giant dinosaurs were gone, never to return. In their place have emerged other powerful and beautiful creatures. And we now know that one small group of dinosaurs did survive the extinction and they are all around us today, the birds.